Hey, what's up, guys? It's Mr. Lee Gamer here today, and I really want to talk to you guys about a gun that I think is really underused and underappreciated, and that's the Weevil. The reason why I say this is because nobody really uses it anymore. A lot of people used to use it back when the, you know the beta and the game first came out because you know it resembled the PDW57 and the P90, and you know those were both really really good guns in and the older Call of Duties. But a lot of people don't a lot of people don't use them now because you know the VMP, the Vesper, and you know the Cuda kind of took over. But, you know, now that both the VMP and the Vesper have been nerfed a little bit, you know, the Weevil is able to, you know, climb up the rank a little bit more. And I'm going to show you a class up that I think will help make it shine. Okay, so what I like to use is I like to use Quick Draw, Grip, and uh, Fast Max. The reason why I like to use Quick Draw and Grip is, you know, to have better accuracy when I'm shooting. I, thi I think I usually rock Quick Draw and Grip on most of my class ups just because I love to have that accuracy. Uh, and then Fast Max, of course, because, you know, the, uh, the, the Weevil has 50 bullets in the clip which is a lot so you really don't need to send the mags and it's always better to be able to reload faster especially when you're in an enemy base you know getting three or four pieces and then you know coming out just to reload and then go back in uh, and then what I like to use with the per the perks I like to use with this class setup is Ghost and Sixth Sense. The reason why I like to use Ghost is because, you know, this is more of a, you know, rushing, uh, slaying class where you want to be invisible on the radar and be, you know, kind of immune to, you know, uh, UAVs and being able to be spotted by, you know, UAVs and haters. And then Sixth Sense, of course, you know, helps you with your awareness to let you know where people are if they're really close to you so you can get the, you, so you can get the drop on them and them not being able to get the drop on you. And then, of course, you know, Scavenger, the reason why Scavenger is because you know you always want to have ammo you never want to be low on ammo especially when you're always rushing the enemy base and then tack mask tack, tack mask I, the reason why i think tack mask is a must is because if you're rushing the enemy base the teammate the enemies will always you know try to flashbang you or uh concuss you so they can blind you and get the kill or you know push you out of their base but of course if you have tack mask that prevents them from doing that also saving you from a few deaths in the process and you can get pick up more kills or allows you to be safe uh on your rush so i I really think this class setup that I have that I use it really you know makes the weevil shine. It, it shines in most you know situations. Of course, it's not ideal for long, long range gunfights, but it is decent for you know medium to short range gunfights. Of course, you know if you're if you're looking for a short range you know slayer, then you know this gun might not be for you, but it's definitely good most you know in most situations. And the and the play style I prefer you know obviously this is rushing, so you want to be rushing. But also, since it takes three to four um, three to four bullets to kill from close to medium, so you kind of want to play a little safe. You don't want to be rushing in people's faces all the time. Of course, you know this is meant for rushing, but you don't want to be like uh, recklessly challenging people because this skin does not melt. It it doesn't have that quick rated you know quick fire rate like the VMP does. But it, like I said, it is very good for most situations. So if you're going to be rushing, make sure you play a little bit of the cover system in the opponent's base so you can get the drop on them or especially get, go aim for the headshot because this gun has very moderate recoil. But hopefully this class setup helps you. If this class setup does improve your game a little bit or, you know, gives you a decent or helps your KD out a little bit, you know, give this video a like, subscribe if you are new to the channel, and I will see you guys next time. Achieved.